I'm back again at the same place, different time, my dear friends. I hope you are doing all right around the world. I'm back again, of course. <laughs> never stop, never get tired. Keep going, keep talking, keep looking. What is happening? Oh boy. Oh my God, the news about Portotino is no ending. Portotino, Portotino. I've never talked about a manager like this. I have never, never. You know, Antonio Conte, we talked about him a little bit. I remember 2017. And Jose Mourinho, yeah, I did not have this channel when Jose Mourinho was in charge of Chelsea. I did not. You know, I had the channel, but I didn't put all the videos. You know, the channel has been up for three years. I just didn't, uh, I was not active. I was too busy doing other stuff. And then I started recently posting the video. So when you see on my channel, when you click on it, when you go, it says three years when I made this channel. And then you see my subscribers, you'll be, you'll be like, three years and you get 5K subscribers. That's not good, you know? It looks like people, they are not supporting you. No, no, no. I did not start that <laughs> long. <laughs> I started recently, you know? So I'm just want to put that out there because I see people messaging me, telling me off. I don't get bothered if people telling me off. It's all right. <laughs> it doesn't bother me, you know? It's okay. Just avoid things because there's a lot of things I see. I just avoid them. I don't even, you know, bother to... Uh, say about it but i'm just saying if other people they have seen the channel for a long time of course now let's get to portatino <laughs> portatino oh my goodness this manager this manager has become a topic of everyone you know and chelsea they have to do something up here we have to keep Portotino. And I'm saying this, it's crazy I'm the one who's saying we have to keep Portotino. I wanted Portotino to get sacked. And look, people who are saying get Portotino out of the club, you know, other people, they're like, he should, be, he should have been sacked when we lost to Arsenal 5 nil. Other people, they're holding that in their heart until now. We got to let go, you know, let go of some stuff. <laughs> Let's move on from the past. Like I said the other day, I have moved on from the past. I have moved, I have moved on. I said, if Portotino win the last game, I, I will move on myself. I don't know about you. I will move on. I won't remember the shenanigans. I won't remember the result. Arsenal won 5 nil at Emirates. I won't remember all that. I'm moving on. I'm starting a new chapter. This is why I'm saying keep Portotino. I don't think... Chelsea knows exactly what they're doing. <laughs> I don't think they do. Look, if we sack Portotino, we start from the scratch. It's not gonna be a cherry on the cake. It's not gonna be like that. We start from the start, and then it's gonna take a long, long time to get where we are right now. Right now, it's creaking. Portotino, the players, they're in love, you know? Not that love, uh, the good love. <laughs> <laughs> Both are good love, but you know, there is that love of the father, you know, and the son, you know, in the house, the father knows exactly what the house need, need. a house needs the uh, shima, African shima, of course, if you eat that, or the house needs uh, soap, we need to get bath, or the, the house needs uh, good meat in the fridge, there's nothing. So, a, a father knows exactly what to provide for, for uh, his family, you know. And the mother loves everybody, loves the father, loves the children. So, gotta be all that. The mother is Chelsea. <laughs> Chelsea has to, you know, support a, a manager, a father. Portutino is a father because he's a manager. He's the manager who's coaching this young team. Did you understand that? You know, sometimes I speak like this. I don't know this way. They just come from somewhere, somewhere. I don't even prepare them. <laughs> and there was a person who said, uh, my videos are too long. I apologize if my videos are too long. I, again, I apologize. Sometimes there's just a lot of things to say. And I don't want um, to spread a video into vi two, two videos. It's just going to take... It's a waste of time, I think. So, 
guys do you think my video are too long let me know down in the comment if they are then i will try to reduce to 10 minutes or 9 minutes or 8 minutes if you want that i need the, i need your vote in the comment if so many people vote yes they're too long and i will just i will try to reduce but if there's a big news i'm sorry <laughs> i gotta talk just like today it's gonna be a long video as you can see exactly let's get into Podotino, of course Chelsea want a, a coach or a coach who will feed into their conversation around potential signing and sales without seeking to ind indicate strategy or make demand. Wow. And commit to working with a talent assembled by a recruitment team. <laughs> Oh my goodness, mate. We don't want an experienced coach. We want somebody actually who doesn't care about uh, the transfer market, who doesn't care about their strategy, who doesn't care about what they are doing in the transfer market, who just sit down and say, yes, boss. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, just do everything for me. I will just coach. I don't want anything. Blah, blah, blah. That's what they want. It's crazy. Oh my God, my club, my club, my Chelsea, what happened to you? What really happened? Oh my goodness, mate. <laughs> Let's continue with Podotino. Mauricio Podotino remains highly regarded by Manchester United and would receive interest from other big European clubs, of course, you know. Chelsea has option too, but also the chance Pochettino stays for continuity and stability. There we go. <laughs> Man United, they put Pochettino on their wrist. Wow, I'm not surprised. I'm not surprised. Man United, they are looking everywhere because they're in trouble. As I said earlier on, they're waiting for Eric Ten Hag and that uh, FA Cup final. See what's going to happen there. I'm telling you right now, Manchester United fans, if you happen to watch this video I don't think you win the FA Cup maybe you need you you need um, you need Manchester City uh, to go to sleep or you need them to drink a lot of beer because they just won the Premier League a lot of beer because most of them drink of course drink and then they forgot they have an FA Cup drink drink and then on the day they are playing FA Cup, they are drunk and they wake up in the morning and drunk and they go play with you drunk. That's what you need them to do. <laughs> Otherwise, I don't think they will see that FA Cup. They, they, um, the way they are performing right now, Manchester United, I just don't see them winning the FA Cup. And we need Manchester City to win the FA Cup, Chelsea. <laughs> yes. <laughs> For us to play European, uh, of course, we're gonna be in Europe, you know, Conference League, of course, but we need Europa League to uh, to play. So we need Man, uh, Man City to win that game. So let's see what's gonna happen. Now, Portotino, yeah, it's been linked to Manchester United. Right now, it does not look good on Portotino. Does not look good. And yeah, I'm worried. Let's continue with Portotino, of course. Chelsea, who are went up whether to sack Mauricio Pochettino, I've spoken to Karen Magnum's repre representative, of course. Now, Magnum, Makina, I'll call him Makina. I had a friend, Makina, long time ago in Zambia. Long time ago. When I used to live, there's a place called Solwezi. <laughs> That's where I used to live with my, in my big brother over there. Yeah, I remember. <laughs> Makina. So I'll call him Makina's representative. So Chelsea spoke to his representative. And this guy just uh, came to the Premier League. You know, he's been promoted from the Championship. I don't remember that team. High Hype Winch? What's, what's the name of that team? I forgot. He just came in, in the Premier League and Chelsea, boom, go for him. Because we want. A young coach. We don't want an experienced coach. Ah, and we don't want somebody who's talking and somebody who's like, okay, I need this, I need this to stay, I need this, this, like Portugino is doing right now. Portugino is changing his mind. He's like, no, 
you know I need this I gave to you everything you needed but now this summer let me be involved in the transfer stuff let's continue talk sports understood Portino will consider quitting if if he is not given a greater say in transfer police Portino want to keep Gallagher but Egbari is open to offers of course it's not new and it's not a surprise Egbari want business to Move on with Chelsea. Egbari. Egbari. Chelsea Egbari. Football clubs, English football club or any other European football club, they don't work that way. The only team that works that way is small clubs. If you want to operate like a small club, it's not going to work at Chelsea. Chelsea is a big football club, you know? And right now, we are operating like Brighton. The, the only difference is Chelsea is a big football club, so we are operating like Brighton and it's, it's not working, you know? It's like this. It can't function properly because the demand is higher. It's higher. At Brighton, yeah, you can do that. You can work like that. This is why I think Desab is leaving because in that blight on team, you know, they need experience. You can't function without experience, without experience coach. You can't function. You just can't. You know, you will go left, right, nothing. Right now, Portutino has find a way to function. At the last minutes, at the last minutes, find a way to function and it's starting to work. Next season, it's smearing very, very good. And you want to sack him. <laughs> Doesn't make sense. You know, we need, I'll repeat that again, we need to keep Pochettino as, at all cost. You know, at least for next season, and let's see where we go. You know, if it doesn't wake up to the summer, as I said earlier in my video, then sack him. But right now, we need to keep Pochettino. The players, they are all with him. You know, if we sack him, we disturb them, the players, because the players, they're the one who play football. They will stop uh, uh, performing. Other clubs, they are looking at Portotino. If Portotino leaves, goes to Manchester United, then, <laughs> I wanted to say too much talk. <laughs> I'm dreaming about talk, man. I am dreaming every time. I think I, I think Portotino leaving, I'm thinking about too much talk. My goodness, <laughs> my goodness, I, I hope that happened, I hope that happened. Now, there is uh, Rose Barkley, right? I mentioned Rose Barkley in my first video, Is going to Aston Villa, and Aston Villa, in the, they're in the Champions League. Talking about Aston Villa, I'm going to come, I'll come back to Rose Barkley. Talking about Aston Villa, Aston Villa, they're in the Champions League after 41 years out of the Champions League. After 41 years, they are back in the Champions League and they have won two Champions League long time ago. What an, uh, an achievement. Yuna Emery is doing magnificent things up there. Wow. I have to say this. If Yuna Emery was at, uh, was at Arsenal and Arsenal they're in this brilliant, you know, form, I think you'll win the Premier League. I, th I think he will, you know, different manager and is is much is a better manager than uh, Michael Tate at Arsenal. Much better. Some people they're gonna disagree with that, but it's much better manager. Let's see this one. For a bishop man who made a mistake, and everybody there on him. <laughs> and I was laughing when I saw this. Look, you know, Emery pushing to sign Rose Barkley as his quality and experience a uh, coincided interest for Aston Villa next season and he went. Talks are taking place in order to reach an agreement with former Man United midfield. What? <laughs> From Bishop Romano, wake up. Wake up. Former Manchester United manager? Are you crazy? <laughs> it's Chelsea. Former Chelsea player midfield. Rose Barkley. Wake up. <laughs> I was laughing about that. What is what is from Bishop Romano thinking? Lost Barkley, former midfield of Man United. Wow, all right. I will say that too. <laughs> no, I won't say that. No, it's not right. All right, let's move on from that. Jokes aside, 
Tony Close, this came as a shock. Everybody shocked by the news. Tony Close, what is happening? Here it is. Breaking, Tony Close retires. He is leaving New Madrid and retiring right after the Euro 2024. Wow. I thought Tony Close is just gonna go to another club, but is retiring and there's a lot of paragraph he said about Leo Madrid he said this is the only club I love and and I was planning to retire here this is why I was quiet I was thinking about this for a long time and I just decided to retire after the Euro legend legend of football not just Leo Madrid legend of all football Tony close and yeah good to see him in football you know legend go and legends they never disappear because they have done so much in football and everybody they're gonna remember you know Ronaldo, Messi if they retire the world will remember them forever forever just so like we remember Maradona uh Zeren Zidane and all these uh legend players you know in the world of football so yeah let me know down in the comment what do you think I will see you soon after Ah, I forgot the Premier League is done. I wanted to say after Chelsea played. Oh my goodness. Thank God the Premier League is done. Thank God the shenanigans is gone. And uh, yeah, look forward to the next season. But we are waiting. I'm going to say this, guys. We are waiting to see who's going to be the Chelsea next manager. <laughs> we are waiting. What a club we support. What a club, man. What a club. Sometimes I miss Romani Barovic. But we are waiting to see who's going to be the next Chelsea manager. If Pochettino gets sacked, are we going to go to Makinas? Like I said, I'm going to call him Makinas because I had a friend who was named Makinas a long time ago. So, Makinas, are we going to appoint that? He just came to the Premier League, as I said. Promoted into the Premier League. From the Championship. Ah, wow. Wow. Let's see what's going to happen. Let's see. I will see you soon. And God bless.